So we're gonna go ahead and you can see there's a lot of bugs in here and stuff like that. So great time to clean the air filter. So I'm back from my trip. The engine bay is filthy and first things we have to do is make sure that uh, the maintenance is well after a long trip. We did about right under a thousand miles uh, to the eastern uh, Sierras and we got into some really bad sud or dust or dirt that was super really bad. So first thing I did is we're going to check the K&N filter. Um, I also picked up a uh, set of uh, K&N rechargeable filter air kit cleaner. Uh, you can could, you could pick this kit up on the description below uh, my Amazon account so make sure to go support your boy and go pick this up uh, but now let's go open up the air cleaner and see how bad it is and also might as well right there clean it out recharge it and clean it out uh, let it dry and recharge it first things we're going to do is wipe down the area so that we don't get some of this dust or loose debris into the into the master sensor or anywhere else uh, just kind of wipe it down as you guys can see, look, it's really dusty. Uh, while we're here, we're also going to do uh, cover up the electrical stuff and we're going to blow blow all this out and hopefully, you know, try to get it as clean as possible. But as you guys can see, it's pretty easy. It's, it's not real thick like mud, but let's, uh, let's just wipe around it before we open up the air box. So one tab, two tabs, three and four. We're going to go ahead and lift it up. bring out the air filter as you can see it got a little of the dust into it but not really uh, you can see I'm gonna, let's see if you can see you can see a dark area right around here uh, that, um, that's from the tube coming in the circle so we're gonna go ahead and you can see there's a lot of bugs in here and stuff like that so great time to clean the air filter so we're gonna go ahead and use our open our kit and clean this bad boy out and then install this back in there and it'll be just like new ready to roll get back on the road picked up the k and recharger um, air filter cleaning kit uh, aerosol one so this is the aerosol one they do offer an oil one but I went ahead and rather because I've dealt with the oil one and it's not fun uh, to spread it out in the each groove but I went to the air filter one so let's go ahead and open this again you can pick this up in my in the description below is we have the cleaner so what you want to do is make sure that you will and I'll go through the steps this is the cleaner you spray on first uh, once you do that you water it down and then once it's completely dried then you want to go ahead and spray the air filter oil as well so pretty pretty basic cleaner rinse dry oil uh, red oil ap apply the red oil and we should be good so let's uh let's start off with the first step which is the cleaner first make sure you read the instruction very well this can cause severe skin burn and eye damage so they are recommending to wear gloves and they are recommending not to s to inhale or breathe the mist and spray so wash your hands thoroughly after handling and wear eye protection so we have the filter you can see it's dirty we're gonna spray this we're gonna let it sit for I don't know about 10 minutes um, I shook it uh, and then we're going to rinse it off so again be very careful hopefully I don't kill the palm tree but yeah so let's spray it again be safe all right we're going to let it sit and then we're going to rinse it off it's been about 10 minutes like the instructions say it says not really high pressure water just rinse it out and you should be good and then, then what we want to do is let it air dry naturally so we'll let this thing sit for quite some time all right i'm gonna shake it a little bit and now we're just gonna let it air dry i'm gonna probably let it air dry overnight because it is in the evening already um it does ask to air dry naturally so make sure to do that it is the next day 
Uh, as you guys can see, the filter is dried. It's white. You see some reminiscence of the red, but for the most part, it's all white on both sides and it's completely air dried by itself. So as you guys can see, so we're, now we're gonna go ahead and uh, apply the <coughs> air filter oil. Like I said, this is aerosol spray. So it should be a lot easier to spray. We're gonna go spray it on both sides. And then we're gonna let it sit about for 20 minutes or 10 minutes on each side so it gets uh, perfect. And then we're gonna go ahead and install it. It has a nice red color. I did tap it to make sure there's no uh, oil leaking over. Um, as you guys can see, we'll do the other side. It's whiter. And we'll let this side as well sit for 20 minutes. We'll let it sit for 20 minutes and then we'll install it. We allowed the air filter to wick and dry for 20 minutes on each side. And I also wiped down any excess oil around the edges and around the top. As you guys can see, uh, it's good. Now we back install it and we should be good to go. I obviously cleaned out the box prior to that. So we have it here. And we should get full performance from our k filter. Make sure we close it back securely. Drops right in. So just like that, we were able to reuse our Canon filter utilizing their cleaner and the recharger uh, oil, or their oil, right? So big shout out to Canon for always providing a, a, a great uh, product uh, for all types of vehicles. So make sure to go go in the description below if you want to pick some of this up and or pick up the filter as well. So I think that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video on how to clean your Canon air filter. Uh, there we go. Here we got it. How to clean, clean your Canon air filter. And yeah, hit a subscribe and we out.